back to my channel. If you are new, then welcome to my channel. It is Dave. I can get another video for y'all. So today we're going to be opening packages. If you guys haven't already read that title, I'm going to start with packages I haven't opened, but I'm going to be honest with y'all, completely honest. I was a little bad because y'all know I try to like wait and then do this video to open all of my packages with you guys. But there were a couple of packages that came early. I needed them, so I opened them, but I have had a chance to use them. So I will be doing some reviews on them so that I can tell you if it's worth buying or not. So yeah, first I'm gonna start with the stuff that I didn't open, obviously. And then towards the end of the video, I'm gonna give you the reviews on stuff that I've used and whether it's worth buying or not. So first we're gonna start off with this box right here. I know where it's from. This is from Dossier. So let me open it. I had a sponsorship with them a few months ago and I absolutely love their perfume actually. So I went back and purchased this myself. So this is not sponsored or wasn't sent to me. So I paid for this with my own coins and this scent right here, look crazy, it's all out of the packaging and everything. I didn't even do that. But yeah, so this right here is the citrus green apple scent. So this scent right here is actually supposed to smell like um, Calvin Klein's light blue, I believe is why I bought it. Um, and I'm just gonna spray it and see how it smells because this is my first time opening it. I think this is a really good spring scent. It's very crisp and clean. That's how I like my perfumes. I don't like really heavy perfume. I just like to smell like just clean, like that clean, fresh scent. So this right here is the Citrus Green Apple and I absolutely love it. I definitely think I got this right in time for spring. So next we have a package from Amazon. Let's go ahead and open this. I know what this is and I'm excited to see it because I custom made it myself or I got it customized myself or whatever. So you guys, I am super excited for this cup. I'm excited to see it. And it's a cute little pink tumbler and it says day by day on it. Let me come closer so you guys can see. So this is what it looks like. It's super cute. As you can see, it's light pink with silver writing and it says day by day, which is my channel name. I'm super excited. It is like a tumbler and inside it keeps all the cold drinks cold and hot drinks hot. So yeah, it's like a um, thermal kind of. And yeah, so this is the cup. I'm super excited about this just because I've been trying to get more like customized things with my logo on it. Y'all saw the hoodie a couple of months back where I got like day by day and everything on a hoodie. So yeah, I was shopping for a tumbler anyway and I just said, why not get something with like your brand name on it? So I got day by day and it also includes, it also includes a steel straw to kind of like go with the aesthetics cause this is kind of like silver and it also has like a straw cleaner in there too. So I absolutely love this. I'm very happy with this purchase and I could definitely see myself taking this to class because yeah, day by day, you see it, you see it. So the next package is from Amazon again. There are a couple of items in here. I believe like four items in here, if I'm not mistaken. So let's go ahead and open this up. Okay, so this Amazon package contains a few things. So let's go ahead and start pulling things out. It looks like this. So this first package is some colorful clip-ins that I got and they're like rainbow colors. I also got some other clip-ins. You guys will see that in a little bit. But yeah, so I got these for like my wigs or my hair or whatever. They're just some colorful clip-ins. And that way you can do like skunk stripes or whatever without having to dye it. And just that whole process can be skipped because you can literally just clip these in. And they come with two of every color. So you can, you know, mix and match, do one on one side, one on one side, do both on one side. It's literally whatever you want to do. I've seen pictures of people putting like all of these in their hair and doing like a rainbow type of thing. But yeah, so it's just a fun way to add some color to your hair without having to dye it or having to go through a whole process. So it's just quick and then you can take it out as well. So yeah, it's just something that was supposed to be like fun and quick. And I just love the fact that clip-ins, you can put them in and literally take them out and you don't have to like sleep with them or nothing. I love clip-ins for that. But yeah, so I got some colorful clip-ins and I'm excited about these. I'm excited about the blue ones. The blue, come on, yeah. I'm very excited to use these over the summer. I'm excited to use these, especially over the summer. They're just very vibrant and colorful. And just look at all these colors. Like look at all these options for your hair. I just think these are so fun and I cannot wait to test them out. So the next thing in the box are some Biore strips. 
I don't feel like these are the absolute best for you, but I do like the fact these will like yank all the gunk and like blackheads out of your pores. And I just been trying to like clean my pores because I just feel like there's like makeup trapped in there, oil trapped in there, whatever. So I've been trying to clean my pores. And so I got some Biore strips. They were like $7. I also purchased some pimple patches just for those pesky breakouts. I feel like I break out most um, around like my girl thing or whatever. So it's almost that time. So I got some pimple patches that way you just put the patch on. They usually like blend in with your skin color. And then at the end, they just pull all of, all of that yuckiness out, like the gunk and pus and all of that. It's gross, but it does the job. So this next item that I got, I'm super excited to try it out. I just feel like this is something new I've just heard of. And y'all know I will try anything once. I will try anything once. So this right here is like a derma roller, but it's specifically for your hair and scalp. I'm gonna take it out so we can see what it looks like. So basically I'm trying to grow my edges back and I've heard that this is a great solution because what it does is poke holes kind of um, where your hair follicles are not growing. So it's gonna like poke a hole and therefore the hair can sprout out and like grow or whatever. So this is what it looks like. So this is what it looks like out of the packaging. It is supposed to have little blades on it um, and you're not supposed to feel it. So we're gonna try this out really quick just on my arm to see if I feel anything. I don't feel anything, like literally at all. It literally just feels like a little bitty prick, but it doesn't hurt whatsoever. So I'm going to use this on my edges along with some black castor oil and see if I see any difference. And I will update you guys in a couple of months. I really want to say like three months of consistency because it takes a while, you know, obviously for hair to grow and I guess to really, really see it change. So give me about three months or so and then ask me if it's working because I'm using this ASAP. Probably starting tonight. So this next item from Amazon, I am very happy about because I needed it. And this is another electric nail drill. Y'all know that I do my nails, but unfortunately my other nail drill, I had it for like two years or so and it now has like a shortage. So I haven't been able to do my nails and baby, I've been wearing press-ons. I've been wearing press-ons for the past week and they've been popping off as y'all can see. This is not cute. It's giving very much ghetto. So yeah, I'm very excited about this nail drill because I've been waiting for it so that I can do my nails. <laughs> because don't get me wrong, I love press-ons. Press-ons are great for the moment. Like if you got a little date night that night or if you need to go out that night and you need to pop some press-ons on, by all means, I'm here for it. But for long wear, I don't recommend press-ons. They just, not it long wear wise. So I've had these on for about a week and they tied, they done. So I got this electric nail drill. I was gonna try to show you guys, but it's a lot of pieces put together. So that's the drill itself. And then they have some other stuff in the box with a bunch of like nail tips and y'all see what's going on. Like it's a lot of nail stuff. So I'm super excited about the new nail drill. Um, so yeah, it's just a lot of different stuff that it comes with, which I'm actually very excited about. Like this whole big old bag of nail files is a godsend because my last nail thing did not, it did not look like this. So I'm super excited, can't wait to use it because these nails gotta go. So the last thing from this Amazon box is this case right here. You guys have seen this. I've literally shown you this a few months ago when I got my macbook so it is literally the same case as this but as you can see mine is all cracked up and looking horrible like look at that so i just got the same one um to kind of replace it because this is horrible so this case is the same exact one on the, my computer right now i just wanted a new one because of the cracks or whatever but i'll open it just so that if you don't know what it looks like i can show you what it looks like Okay, so this is what it pretty much looks like. It's just a clear case because I like the color of my laptop. So I just like clear cases and they're kind of hard. I mean, they're not super hard. It's still kind of like plastic, but they're hard enough to protect um, your MacBook or whatever. So I do like this case, but it's not super, super durable. So if you need something more durable, um, I don't recommend this case, but I do like the fact that it's clear. So moving on to more exciting news. I have been waiting a while. I've actually had this package sitting here for like two, three, maybe four weeks, if I'm not mistaken. So I got something new and I cannot wait to show you guys. I'm excited. I feel like I'm part of a club now. 
because I didn't have this, but now I do. So baby, guess what came in the mail? I gotta tell Feezy's. And that's plural, multiple. So I purchased these bags um, during their like bag protection program or something, whatever they have. It's like twice a year where you can purchase any bag um, pre-order pretty much and it takes a while to get there. So I ordered these literally like October, September, October, so long ago. I got these months and months and months ago and they're finally pretty much just getting here. Like So I did go a little overboard and I got three, but I feel like I've been wanting these bags, but they're always sold out. Like they're always sold out. I can never get them. It's very frustrating. And that's really, I think the beef everybody has with Teflar, like we get it, it's exclusive, whatever, whatever, but it's just like, why is it always sold out? Why is it so hard to obtain? So it's like after this, I don't know. I don't know if I even want any more Teflar bags. I'm not gonna say that I don't, but I don't know. I just feel like that process is very like annoying, if that makes sense. Like their bags are just always sold out and they're just so hard to get. Literally, I remember waking up, setting my alarm. Let me start opening this for y'all get mad at me. But I remember like setting my alarm literally for like 9 a.m. to get one of the bags. Literally was putting in my information. The bag was sold out. I was so mad. Like it's just way too hard to get the bag. So this first one, baby, this first one, oh, yes, right on time for spring. I wanted this bag. I tried to get it. It was sold out. Yeah, I tried to get this bag. It was sold out. I absolutely love this mint green color. This is so cute to me. This bag is very much tiny, but I do love tiny purses. I'm not really fans of like big, big bags unless I have to um, pack a lot of things, but that's usually never the case. I'm usually like a phone, lip gloss, keys type of girl, like just bare minimum. So I do love this little um, mint green bag. It's so cute. I don't know what I'm gonna wear with, but baby, I got it. Like I got it. So moving on to the next one, I got another one in this color. I want it so bad. This is the one that I tried to buy, but it was sold out in two minutes. So this color right here, yeah. This color right here, yeah, okay. Look at her. Wow, she's beautiful. This color is everything. It's actually crazy because I'm starting to really like the bubblegum pink one and also that corned beef one that just came out. Baby, that corned beef is everything. That color is like perfect. That is the perfect shade of pink. But I do love this though. It's giving fierce. Like this is a very fierce color. I love this. So the last one I got is a medium, I believe. I'm not sure what the sizes are. Those are small. I think this is a medium, but this is a big body bins. Like this is a big bag. I don't even like big bags like that. But yeah, this is like a tote for real. And I just got this one in a nude color. I just feel like this best fits my wardrobe because I wear a lot of like brown and neutral tones. So I've been thinking about going to like cafes and stuff to edit my videos. Kind of just, I need to get out the house more. So I bought this bag in the hopes of it being like my editing bag, if you will. Just a bag to put my computer in. I don't know why I'm trying to make this complicated. I just wanted a bag that could fit my computer in besides my um, tote bag. So this bag is what this is for. And yeah, I just love the coloring. The quality on these, it's not as flimsy as I thought it was going to be. And it's not as flimsy as other people make it out to be. So I was very scared about getting um, Teflar bags because everybody just complains that there's no structure, there's no pockets, there's nothing in the bag, but the bag. Oh, this one got a pocket in it. This one has a pocket on the side. So I feel like listening to other people, it kind of gave me a bad like bias towards it because I didn't know what to think. I thought it was going to be very flimsy because that's what people say. And then I just thought the inside was not going to have any type of structure, or, you know, or nothing inside. And it's actually not bad. So I don't know what they're talking about, but baby, I like it. I feel like I like it. So, babes, these are the Tofeezies I got. I'm happy to share this moment with you because, yeah, these are these are cute. But let's move on to the reviews. Okay, so now it's time for the reviews. And I'm going to start with the number one thing that I feel like I've used the most. Baby, it's this heating pad. I got this heating pad from Amazon. All this stuff is from Amazon. Um, so I got this heating pad from Amazon. When I say it's a game changer, a life changer i've been using this every single day since i got it so this right here is a heating pad it has a cloth over it so it doesn't get too hot on your skin i used to have that old school um heating pad where it was just 
like it was just the heating pad and so it used to get too hot and it used to like burn my skin so yeah i got this one it comes with three settings i don't have it plugged in but it comes with three different settings so there's a low a medium and a high it gets really really hot so i usually only keep it on like medium i never really go to the hot setting because it does get really really hot so this material right here is very very soft and cozy like you don't even feel the heating pad you just feel like a cloth a warm cloth if that makes sense so i absolutely love this i use this every single night and another thing that i want to say is that if you leave it on it only stays on for about 45 minutes to an hour and it cuts off by itself and this heating pad has literally changed my life like i'm not even exaggerating i use it every single day i highly recommend for anybody because i feel like it's great for back pain that's really what i got it for but if you are a woman it also helps spread like those period cramps oh my gosh it helps so much my best friend also has the same exact one and we literally like talk about it like girl i can't wait to go home and get into bed with my heating pad like that's what we talk about so yeah this heating pad is number one okay moving on to go with the heating pad i actually bought this like chiropractor board um from amazon i do like it however i feel like the way they advertise it it's just very dramatic um, the way that they promote it is kind of like you lay on it and all your bones are supposed to like crack 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 now they do crack but it's not as dramatic as the videos make it seem okay so this is the board right here i love this board so much so what you're gonna do is put like your um bottom here like your butt here and you're gonna lay back and this is gonna be on like the mid of your back and it just stretches out your muscles so good I use this like maybe twice a week and I just lay on it for like five to ten minutes. It's very relaxing for me and it just really helps me with like my lower back. I have like lower back pain. So I just feel like this has been really helpful for me personally. So that's why I wanted to give a review on it for you guys if you're suffering with back pain. So yeah, if you're suffering from back pain, I just highly recommend this board. It looks like this. Mine is kind of messed up, but it has like a cushion here. And then these little things right here, they look like they hurt, but they actually feel really good like in your back. And then also right here it has three different settings. So this is the highest one. This is the lowest one and it works like that. So moving on, I told you guys that I got some clip-ins and I'm going to give a slight review. I wish my hair was straightened so that I can literally like show you, but I don't know when the next time I'm going to straighten my hair is because I'm trying to like get it healthy. So I want to show you these clip-ins. I have like one video of me having these in, but so these are my clip-ins. I've only worn them once. I have like a video like a five second clip of them in my head i didn't take pictures i don't know why but yeah i do like these i was very concerned at first i was very concerned at first purchasing these i feel like they are a bit overpriced yeah but i also feel like the texture of them they look horrible now because i haven't straightened them but the texture of them i feel like it matches my real hair very well so what it's supposed to do is mimic kind of like black women's hair it's kind of like textured it's not like bone straight i was extremely skeptical about these clip-ins but putting them in my like straightened hair they blend perfectly when i say it looks like my hair it was perfect so these hair extensions are from the brand lovrio again they are overpriced i think they were like 80 dollars i gave them a shot some people say they need um more than one pack but for me honestly to achieve that natural looking this is my hair look I only needed one pack. So this is the 18 inch. They come with different sizings as well. I'm trying to show you guys fast, but they come with different sizes so that you guys can um, basically like put them where they need to go in your hair to fill out your hair and make it thicker. So yeah, I do love these clip-ins. I haven't tried to curl them, um, but I did straighten them and they straighten beautifully with my hair. So, so I feel like I am pleased with them. However, I do think that they were a little overpriced. I feel like they're more like worth maybe $40 than $80. But, but yeah, I did like the fact that they blended very seamlessly with my hair. So yeah, these extensions, I really do love them. So next is this foot mask right here. It came in a pack of three. I only have one more because I tried them and then my mom tried them. We did them at the same time. These right here, it did not work for me. So I wouldn't recommend these. They did not work for me personally. But for my mom, she did say that it works for her. Um, these are like those little TikTok foot things where your foot is supposed to like peel off. It didn't happen for me like nothing really happened. It didn't make my feet smoother. So I wouldn't buy these like I wouldn't recommend. 
but maybe it's just me because my mom said it worked for her so i don't know if it's just my feet or what but i wouldn't waste my coins on the foot mask or not this brand and this brand is from owl owl Vier. so next on the list is liquid chlorophyll i bought this from amazon as well i've been seeing this well i used to see it all over tiktok you know tiktok the trends it'd be going so yeah i used to see it a lot on tiktok and i wanted to try it as far as all of the benefits that it has one of the main benefits I really wanted it for was just like gut health, um, feeling more energized and getting my skin to clear up. So I've been just drinking chlorophyll. I drink it mm, anywhere between one to three times a week. I don't really do it every single day. and I'm not going to sit here and lie and say that I do it every day. Um, is it nasty? It is, but it's bearable. And it's even more bearable if you put lemon, like lemon juice or lemon slices in your water. So I just take a bottle of water, put my chlorophyll in, put some lemon slices in, and I can literally just like down it. It's not like horrible, but it does have a taste. Like you're gonna taste it, but it's not like, you're not gonna die. It doesn't taste like medicine or anything. So this liquid chlorophyll, I highly recommend. Um, I feel like I've been seeing changes, but I don't know if it's because of the chlorophyll or the fact that I've been just changing kind of my lifestyle a little bit more. So I don't know what exactly is helping me, but I'm going to continue to drink it. And my bottle is like right here. So I've actually been really going through this. And this right here is a spray. I think it's for pain and like burns instead. But what I use it for, I'm gonna let y'all know. So this right here, I got this when I got my nips pierced. They are pierced. So I got my nips pierced. I use this and I just have been using it ever since. So this came in a pack of two, it was like $10, but this is really good to have if you have piercings because you spray it, it relieves pain, it cleans out like that hole, I guess, I was gonna say wound, but like the hole, because if you know anything about nip piercings, they kind of never really heal. Like mine have never fully really healed. So you'll have periods where they just like very sore or they get like crusty and it's, it's horrible, but this back team, baby, you put this spray on, you're gonna be a-okay, get this spray. So yeah, if you have piercings, that's what I use it for, so that's what I'm gonna recommend. Then I recommend this back team, like spray you some back team on there and you're gonna be a-okay. So the next items that I got are this um, Pearl Bright Teeth Whitening Powder. Um, I've never tried anything like this before, so this was my first time. And then I also got this Venus Visage Bright White like whitening pins basically for your teeth. So I'm gonna talk about this one first because I've actually been using this one and I'm gonna show you what it looks like. Like I've been using the F out of this, okay? I've been using this like not every day cause I'm not gonna lie to y'all. It was every day the first week and then I went to like every other day and now I'm kind of like every two days using it, yeah. So opening it, it looks like this. I'm down to the bottom because I've been using it for real. And it's like a paste. And what you're gonna do is like wet your toothbrush, dip it in there, and then you're gonna brush this stuff on your teeth, just your teeth for like two minutes. And it's supposed to whiten, help whiten your teeth. Now, I don't know if this solely has helped with brightening my teeth because I do other things to brighten my teeth as well. But I want to say that it has helped keep them consistently white. I drink a lot of coffee and I also am a smoker. So it tends to, those things tend to make my teeth like very yellow, but with this, and the fact that I have like a whitening kit like together has made my teeth, um, you know, like it doesn't stain and they kind of like keep color. They're not super white, but um, I just feel like with my bad habits, they could be a lot worse. And these products have been helping me to keep my teeth you know, like decent and not yellow and not embarrassing, you know? So in case you don't know what whitening pens look like, they look like this. This is like hydro something, baby. I'm not a dentist. It's something that's supposed to go on your teeth to help you like peroxide or something, hydroxide, I don't know. It's supposed to be put on your teeth and you use a UV light um, to make your teeth whiter. So this is what this looks like. And my kit is somewhere, so I can't show you. So yeah, this is what they look like. Um, I just feel like personally, I wouldn't recommend if you don't have the UV light, um, but that's just my opinion, do as you please. So yeah, that's what these look like. Okay, lastly, in this very long review, I have this too for my pores. I don't know what this is called. I don't know what exactly this thing is called, but I wanna say it's like a face, a face, 
blade or something. I don't know, child. So this is what it looks like. And basically you're supposed to like, obviously wash your face and all of that, and then take it and scrub out all the um, bad gunk out of your pores. So yeah, this is what it looks like. Turning it on, it's like that. And they have like different modes. Do y'all hear that? So yeah, it does that and they have like different modes. So this thing I've only used once and it did get a lot of dirt out of my face. So I will use it again, but I don't know how worth it, it is versus like getting just like pore strips or something. But I did invest into this as well. Okay, babes that is everything i'm sorry for the long video but we got to open some packages and i also gave you my honest reviews on some amazon products every single thing in this video if it is available then it will be listed down below in the description y'all already know i got you with the links so yes that is the end of this video i hope you guys enjoy make sure you give this video a thumbs up comment down below subscribe to my channel and make sure you turn that post notification bell on so the next time that i drop a video babes so you will be notified also, make sure you follow me on Instagram for daily content, and I will see you guys in my next video. I love you guys so, so, so much, and I will see you next time.